Hello everyone! Today is December 3rd. Happy Vlogmas! So today is just one of those days where I am just chilling in the house. Um, I'm working of course, but um, this evening I have plans to go to a party. So that's going to be a lot of fun. I just need to figure out what I'm going to wear because I haven't really gone holiday outfit shopping because we've been home. <laughs> we haven't been going anywhere. So it's like, mm, what do I do? So um, I'm going to just have to like go through the old sweaters and stuff and see what looks festive and see what's going to look cute tonight. Um, but it's mostly like a dinner party. So it is a party where it's uh, all inclusive. So there's going to be drinks, there's going to be cocktails, there's going to be food and everything is Trinidadian Christmas cuisine. So I'm going to get to show you what it really is. And I, I'm so excited. I cannot wait. I'm so like, I'm already hungry because, you know, I love food. So whatever. You see, I'm starting to sweat. I'm getting excited about the food. What is wrong with me? Anyway, um, so yeah, that's, that's what's going to happen tonight. Oh, one more thing. I would like to add that I actually got day one of Vlogmas to post last night. I, I uh, put on Instagram this morning that it's up and running. And I am just ever so thankful to all of you who have watched it already and just sent me a positive message saying thank you, saying that you've missed me and you were happy to see that I'm vlogging again. I really, really want <clears throat> to, I see this as a challenge because it's difficult to do 24 videos every single day, right? So um, I'm just, I want to challenge myself to really get it done. I want to challenge myself to show you the best of what I can within these 24 days. Um, you know, we're still in a pandemic. Things are limited, but there are still things that you can see in the city, places that you can go, that you can um, have fun. And there are still lots of knitting tips and tricks that I can share. And if I can, I will. So I just wanna thank you again for um, just being here. And I appreciate every every person who, if you get a little inspiration from something that I've done, whether it's you know a hair product I've used or a lipstick or a yarn, a certain colorway or a specific pattern or you know, you saw me bump into one of my friends who happens to be a great designer and you want to check out her stuff. That, like anything that I can do to inspire you on your creative journey and just for happiness in life, I am all here for it. So again, thank you all for just participating and I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so, so very much. Now, we're going to get to the goodies. And for lunch today, I ordered fried shrimp with french fries because why not? It was a quick meal and they delivered it very quickly. Of course, I have to have tartar sauce, ketchup, and hot sauce. Come on now, we gotta have this. So this is gonna be my lunch today and it's Uber Eats and the place was really, really close by. They said 25 minutes and they got here faster than that, which is awesome. So I'm gonna dig in right now. So I am back. I am party ready right now. And I just want to give you a little glimpse into what I put on my face. Um, before I had on Fenty Beauty, well, I still have it on, <laughs> Fenty Beauty foundation and um, some MAC uh, blush and a little Fenty Beauty um, what do they call it? Kilowatt highlight. But I added a little more to be a little more rose goldy. And I also got Stila eyeshadow. This is a liquid eyeshadow. It's called Rose Gold Retro. I'll zoom in so you could kind of see like what's going on there. So yeah, that's, that's, it, it's so easy. You just put it on and that's it. <laughs> and then um, for the lipstick, I use this liquid lipstick because I'm going to be eating a lot and I it stays on. I don't want it, you know, I don't want to put anything too glossy because it's going to like fall right off. So I'm going to, I got this. It's Pat McGrath in uh, Divine Rose, right? But then what I did is I took Divine Romance, this matte trans lipstick, and I just did like that to deepen the red color, the pink color, sorry, the pink color. So um, that's my look. 
and it would not be complete without sparkle so I got this really glittery sparkling top I got it off of Amazon a while back so it's just been in my wardrobe I found it I <laughs> didn't have to go buying anything new for the holiday party but what I want to highlight is my earrings from designs by Yasmin my friend Yasmin so I made these at the beginning I got these, sorry, she made them. I got them at the beginning of the pandemic. We were supposed to go to Montreal and I had yarn for a sweater that I was gonna wear when I was up there and we were at knit night and I said, hey, um, if I give you yarn, can you like make it, you know, make a, make the, the earrings for me? She said, sure, no problem. So I gave her the skein of yarn. She wound off a little bit. It was not even a lot. I was like, that's it. <laughs> and then, you know, I invoiced her the money and within like a week, my, my earrings were ready and this is them. And I'm so glad that I can wear them. I'm not going to a knitting event, but I am wearing something that is fiber related and I love it. I love that um, our, the things that we make aren't just for us at our events. You know, it's for the whole world to see. So I am wearing my Designs by Yasmin earrings tonight. And I have a feeling like I'm going to be around some girls who are really fashion forward and very fashion conscious. And they're probably going to be like, oh, where'd you get your earrings? So Yasmin, please expect some traffic on your page because I will have them follow you. Yes, I will. Because I look out for my friends, <laughs> especially when they make really good beautiful pieces so here you go um so yeah i'm gonna uh get ready well i am ready so i'm gonna get uh squared away with going to the party i just spoke to a friend of mine who's there right now and she says girl you got time they still setting up this is the thing nobody wants to show up at the party when everyone's setting up right so they want to go when you know the drinks are flowing everything's like going good but you don't, you don't want to go so late that you miss the party so now I'm sitting here killing time so what I'm going to do is try to compile yesterday's video because it didn't happen last night so this is what you have to do as someone who's trying to do all the things you have to get it in where you can fit it in so I'm squeezing in some editing time as I'm already dressed for the party I'm gonna call another friend of mine she was working late so she was all worried that she was gonna miss the party so I'm gonna check up on her make sure she's gotten her work done and see if you know she's ready to go or is gonna be ready you know whatever whatever so all that to say I'm ready <laughs> I can't wait. I want to eat and I want to dance. So uh, I will show you what's happening when I get there. Good news. I just finished editing the video from yesterday and it is compiling right now. The party started about an hour ago. So I think that is the opportune time for me to get myself going and leave, get there, drive, find a parking spot it's in a residential area so hopefully you know somebody will leave to go to dinner and i'll take their spot hopefully maybe possibly hopefully i'm not spinning around for hours on end trying to find parking but i'm gonna head out there now i just spoke to my friend who's working late she's still working she's like oh i'm not gonna make it i'm like womp womp <laughs> it's friday night come on but i know you know duty calls so i just have to send her pictures so I'm gonna head to the party now and I will show you what it's like when I get there.
about almost three in the morning i had a fabulous time at the party if you couldn't tell by how amazing it was with the video i just shown you um there's no knitting getting done tonight <laughs> i will show you more tomorrow and i had a fantastic time the live band was amazing the food was amazing um, I ate things that I haven't had in many, many years. And, um, it's just the whole Christmas spirit was just filled in the room. And I am just very happy. So, yeah, I'm really tired. So I'm going to call it a night tonight for Vlogmas. And I will see you again tomorrow morning for day four. So have a good night. Happy Vlogmas! Vlogmas! <laughs>